outpost. We better hurry. Yes. We need to attack now. Southwest gate is still free. We can get the food inside. Under a hail of arrows from English archers. They won't attack. Look at those campfires. The English have grown lazy. They're not prepared to fight. If we go inside peacefully, there's not even a chance that they can react. Then we can make our plans from inside Orléans. I've had enough of this. I don't take orders from women or children. And you're both. Go back home or stay out of my way. You want to command this army without me? Go ahead. There's not a single soldier who will risk his life for you if I'm not by your side. You're my captain, Captain. We do this together. All right. But half the army will stay behind to cover our tracks. Dumetz, keep the men ready to charge in case we get in trouble. If we get inside, if we get inside, stay here. Wait for the signal to attack. Sir. Jean won't be going with us? Bloody great lot of them. Get Sir William. Idiot. You just let the maid of Lorraine into Orleans. Prepare for battle! Better open the south gate. Closing ranks. They're getting ready for us. Suppose it's too late to turn back? I shall raise a war cry against you that will be remembered forever. <laughs> if you refuse, I shall raise a war cry against you that will be remembered forever. I shall not write further. And who do you think you're going to send to deliver this? Hmm? Not one of my men. Maybe one of God's angels will take it for you. <laughs> they are, after all, already in heaven. I'll take it. Raymond.
what they do to that boy. You fill them with righteous nonsense. They won't kill him. He's worth a ransom the French can always be counted on to pay. We should have heard from them by now. We need to attack as quickly as possible. No, we must give the English a chance to leave peacefully. Leave? Peacefully? Look at them. With each passing moment, they become more organized, more prepared to fight. We still have an advantage. 5,000 men on the south bank of the Loire. We must strike now. If there's even a chance of winning without shedding blood, then we have to try it, Captain. Listen to me. I was at Agincourt. I've seen the English at their best. Four thousand strong. Glory of France. Our men and horses and heavy armor, banners held high. We rode to meet the English invaders. But it had rained all night. And I feel the battle was muddy. And the mud ensnared our horses and our men. There were only 500 of them, but their armor was lighter. And the methods... Their methods... They slaughtered us like pigs. Even after we had surrendered. should strike hard and fast, Captain. But not the smaller forts. We should win Le Tourelle first. It's a fortress. It's designed to keep people out. But the English got in. It's our forts. We built it. Surely we can find some weakness. Find one. And I'll consider it. anyone we can talk to? No. Well, there was Victor, the gatekeeper. He grew up here. He lived in Littorel, but... What? He has the plague. Keep this on. You mustn't take it off. And touch nothing. You hear me? Nothing. In this cloak. Burn it as you're leaving. For God's sakes, child. Be careful. Don't worry, Mother Brother. I'll be all. must be a weakness, some way to get in that nobody knows about. It's a impenetrable, like a stone chimney. Chimney? Was there ever a fire? No. No, we were very careful. There, was, there wasn't even straw on the ground. The ramparts, what are they made of? Wood. Thank 
Thank you, Victor. From all of your countrymen. Thank you. Dear maid. Yes. Bless me. This will protect you. Thank you, Mother Rabbit. Okay. They're bedding the horses down inside Le Tourelle. We need to set fire to the hay. The smoke will force them to lower the drawbridge. And we'll be waiting for them outside. Makes sense. We will take Le Tourelle first. Don't get so excited. Hoping to get a flame over the wall into a bale of hay is uh, it's like trying to predict where lightning will strike. But it's a good plan. If it works, it's a good plan. But while you're planning it, the rest of us will fight like soldiers. Then promise me that we will wait another day for their response. Peter! Peter! What's happening? We're preparing for battle. Captain Lahir's orders. Where is he? He's with the Count Dunois. Agreement, Captain. Explain that to them. There's the answer to your letter. They're sending for reinforcements. We attack. Hot-headed, who lead us to our deaths. He's survived many battles. He must know what he's doing. Has he ever fought a battle for God? Who knows how God chooses his soldiers? Look at us. Hmm? this boy has to offer. How much longer do we have to wait? Till we hear the signal. What if the trumpeter's lips are frozen? <laughs> then you'll be spared from combat, old friend, and live to see another day. Right now, dying and going to hell sounds very cozy. Ugh. Didn't mean that. You're afraid, Bertrand? Never seen you afraid. It's a long time ago since I trained to be a knight. Didn't succeed, and now I've forgotten what I know. Ah, <laughs> it'll all come back to you. The moment you see those ramparts lined with rows and rows of English archers. Oh, I should have worked harder at becoming a knight. Well, then, you would not have become my squire, and I would not have known true friendship. Don't be sentimental, Jean. You scare me out of my wits. We have to get in the battle position. What about the signal? There! There's your signal! Everybody! Battle positions! Let's go! Dominus Pobisco, in nomine Patris, et Fili, et Spiritus Sancti. Amen.
shouldn't pray, Captain. Oof. I don't need prayers. I watched brave men pray to live and die in agony. And I watched wounded men pray to die and have to live in agony. I watched my own back. And now, maybe even yours. Flame must strike here. I can do that. As soon as we set fire, we must find Louis or he'll suffocate. Yes, sir. These men are willing to die for you. Perhaps you should say something to them. Because we are guided by the King of Heaven! We're all in God's hands! Even those who choose to think otherwise.
Why can't I hear our men fight? Our men have pulled back. Let's oh. take off our armor. Trip. You'll bleed to death. Break it off. Joe, one can't. Do it. I found on this. get inside, we have to find Louis. I am the maid. Must be with healthy sons who have taken for themselves healthy wives. <laughs> well, two of three so far. Next will be our Pierre. Yes, yes. To the sons. Shock the art. <laughs> to my sister Joan. The maid of Lorraine. To the wives of my sons. Though they be not of my flesh, these two young lasses are more daughter to me than one who thinks she's as good as a man and better than her own blood. God puts us where he wants us. And by God, it's up to us to stay there and make the best of it.
I'll go for Louis. Get me out of here! Get me out! Get me out! Get me out! Release him! 